Good evening. Hundreds of people turned out on Bexhill seafront today after a sculpture of a black woman was defaced by vandals. The sculpture, seated in front of the Delaware Pavilion, had her entire skin spray-painted white. The gallery invited the community to help remove the paint in what it called an act of peaceful resistance, as Chrissy Reedy reports. Like so many visitors who come to Bexhill to enjoy the view, the sculpture is of a black woman looking out to sea, contemplating life. But on Monday night, vandals attacked the sculpture, every bit of her skin spray-painted white. I think it's pretty obvious what's happened here, isn't it? I mean, obviously, tensions are running high in the town for various reasons. I wouldn't want to say directly, but I think it's pretty obvious, isn't it? The reaction from many in the community was clear today as hundreds came out to help clean up the mess. One feels sad that somebody would take the time and effort to deface this sculpture in a very racist way. We live in a diverse culture, in a very diverse country, and there's nothing wrong with that, and I think we should be celebrating that. For one person that has made this vile act, how many people are here today to make it a better place? After you do it, just give it a wipe. So it... I think this proves that this is not a racist town, and it's really quite upsetting to see them trying to paint this town as um, an unwelcoming area. Seated proudly represents the beauty of both blackness and femininity. A statement was read out on behalf of the American artist Shabalaba Self. Painting the skin of my sculpture white is an obscene act and I feel horribly for individuals in Bexhill on Sea for whom this event may have shocked or frightened. The sculpture will be restored to how the artist intended her to be, a strong woman seated with confidence who has every right to be here. Chrissy Reedy, BBC Southeast Today, Bexhill.